What's going on guys? How y'all doing today? This is Keisha with 924 Photography and we have pink meats in the building. Yes, sir. Today we're doing a 60 second, but it's probably going to be longer than 60 seconds. We're doing a video in the bathroom. It is called the toilet challenge. So I want you to hashtag your toilet challenge when you do it. So we came down to Fort Worth camera. I had to have a whole meeting to make sure this thing was still in the parameters so we don't get any backlash. So the thing about this challenge is she has to be touching the toilet in some form or fashion. So I know she's gonna bring it to me, so let's get started in just a second. But we're gonna be using the Sony A7R Mark IV with the 16 to 35 Zeiss lens, uh, courtesy of Fort Worth camera. I also have the Ninja Atmos, so I'll be putting on my screen what I see. And we are using the Hollyland Mars 300 Pro to transmit it back to my friend Lundahl back here so she can see it on my 14 inch panel. So without further ado, let's get started right now. Sniff test. <laughs> hey man, hold on, man, hold on. We gotta make sure you got the toilet clean, man. Hold on. So what we did for pink shoot. Oh, you turn it, you turn it upside down, didn't you? Oh, okay, so Lonnie Tur uh took the soon well uh upside down and maybe I need maybe I need to take a picture of it in the toilet. You think that's a good thing to put on Amazon that I put it in the toilet for a shoot? Oh no, <laughs> Hey, this is the bloopers. Oh my god. This is gross. <laughs> hey, next person come out on my shoot. Y'all gonna definitely have to hold this light right here. Oh man, this is some of the grossest stuff. Uh, but what's cool about this soon with, oh, I got toilet water. Look, it's gross. It's, it's holding it in. Listen, what's good about this shoot is, I mean, this this light, this soon well, it is waterproof and magnetic. So even if you put it in your toilet, your sink, your bathtub, or whatever, you see it's still working, it is definitely go uh, good. <laughs> man, Lonnie, man, you crazy, man. We put this thing in the toilet and I, I touched it. He told me to put some spit on my elbow because it was ashy, but yes, you did. You told me to touch it. <laughs> I put my hand in the freaking toilet. Listen. <laughs> this is Keaton with 924 Photography, man, and I'm a toilet master. 
Today, I'm going behind the scenes on how we shot pink minks in this bathroom at Fort Worth Camera. So let me take you through a few things that I use. Main thing that I use on majority of my shoots is a video transmitter. A video transmitter can, uh, if you don't have a mirror, can help your model. So I was using this Wixamax, well Max it, <laughs> with Max, a uh, 14 inch touchscreen monitor. Uh, with the Hollyland Mars 300 Pro. The reason why I like using the Hollyland Mars 300 Pro is because it has an HDMI in and an HDMI out. That's what I'm using over here on my monitor on the side over here. Uh, we got it going on the A7R Mark IV with the Ninja V Atmos, and I have it going out of the camera into the Atmos, out of the Atmos going into the 300 Pro. This 300 Pro can go up to 300 feet so I really love, this is my very favorite one to use out of all of them. Now, what we did is we used the Hollyland and I turned this monitor around because we're not outside. It doesn't have that many nits. So Pink Minx could see herself uh, in the bathroom. So she was able to pose and give me a dope pose because she was able to see herself here without me, uh, without me having to direct her. So that made this whole shoot easy. Uh, courtesy of Fort Worth Camera, we use the Peak Design. Uh, which, which one is this? This is the Travel Tripod. Huh? Right here? It's the Travel Tripod. It's the Peak Design Aluminum uh, Travel Tripod, and it's 349. So we use this uh, to get our composite shot for Pink Minks uh, shoot. Now, with this tripod, it has a little holder down here that you can put your bag on so your um, uh, tripod does not move in windy areas and then if you turn this knob and press it down and go go into it like this you have a foam mount that's right underneath uh, this thing this tripod that you could put onto the top of here and you can use it for your foam mount so I'm gonna move this back up just a little bit right here and I'm gonna put this back in so you just put it in there and then you just turn it in and you lock it in. There we go. And it goes back in there. So this is the Peak Design tripod. It's pretty dope. Uh, it helped us get the shot. We also were using the Sony A7R Mark IV. We used the 16 to 35, courtesy of Fort Worth Cameras Rental Studio. Uh, we It was a Zeiss. Is it the Zeiss one? Yeah, it's the Zeiss one. Yep, it's the Zeiss Sony one. This lens is super sharp. Uh, on top of my camera, I have my trigger but we didn't use any lights so it's just up there for show and then like I said earlier we used the Ninja Atmos uh, V to record all our footage uh, in raw on here so yep and then the lights we used was the pocket lights F7 uh, by Falcon Eyes we used this Soonwell MT1 Magic 2 that we put into the uh, toilet and we used a Nanlite uh, Little Light C 5C to light it. Oh, you know what? I did have another light in there. I had the Nan Light uh, 6C, the Pavo tube. So, yep, we had one more we could have used. But anyway, guys, so I hope that you like this behind the scenes for Hollyland. Uh, I really love their products and I'll put a link in the description below. So I'm gonna see y'all. Oh, before I'm done, let me say thank you to Lonnie Strickland, uh, LRS Photog. You can follow him on Instagram and YouTube at Lunny Strickland. You should definitely go follow his channel. He has a lot of reviews. He's very technical and he will get you into some good stuff for a lower price because he's cheap. <laughs> I think my tongue is messed up from the toilet water. <laughs> yep, look at that. Ah, man, that monitor is dope. Look at all those lights back there in the back. All right, thank you again to Fort Worth Camera. We're going to see y'all in our next video. Peace.